this is like, I'm sorry, I don't want to sell to any black or brown people. And I'm like, I'm sorry, you don't have a choice. All money is green. Right. You know, and well, the one I laugh about now, I don't know if you guys have this on the real estate side, leading a lending team, you know, the, the, um, mortgage application mm -hmm. has a section on there. What is your gender? They only give you two options. Sorry. Um, and what is your race? What is your ethnicity? Um, but you can't, we got to collect all this data and they, they make the, the, the loan officer. If you're doing a face-to-face -face application, you have to make an assumption, right? I, I've got to assume that Lisa's a white female, right? Which is funny because I'm mixed race. Right, but... But, but the, you can't tell by looking at me. Yeah, but the, the irony is you can't use it for anything, but you got to collect the data. Yeah, <sighs> yeah, no, and I agree. I think that that's ridiculous, you know, and, and the Fair Housing and Discrimination Advisory, a group of us, I was one of five people that proposed it to the um, executive officers uh, at the California Association of Realtors because we only had one line in our contract saying that we were equal opportunity housing providers, period. And it's like, I think we need a little bit more than that. So, you know, we I've done a lot of work on that, uh, on the CID issues here on the state. Wait, 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 back up. CID? Common interest development. Okay. You know, all of your, shall we say, condo projects that maybe are having problems right now with balcony inspection rules and being underinsured. How about getting insurance? Yeah, yeah you know, <laughs> and all of that kind of stuff. 